chained and a lot is going on in his mind looks like he has a, like a very troubled mind anxiety depression so much going on but the keys are hanging there for him to unchain himself but he can't do that you get so he has the keys to liberate himself but he isn't wow interesting this one has the map of Africa right in, in the middle of it you know but all around it is just suffering, you know, people trying to look up there. That's, I feel like those are people trying to leave Africa, but they're getting drowned and stuff. Look at it. A ship which is overloaded with people. You look at people who are in chains. All around Africa, just bad things happening and people trying to leave. Here, someone is killing someone who is supposed to be close to the person. 
you know, people are in jail, in bondage, in suffering. Africa is literally crying. Ha! Man, I'll get an A plus in Africa. Um, um, this is by Jerry Shita. Look at this one, guys. This is pretty much an amber man. You can know by that, this sign here. You know that this is a grass field man fighting with his demons, you know, trying to liberate himself from chains. Man, look at that. Chains that they used to hold a Bamenda man, a grass field man, and he's liberating himself. Guys, look. This is somebody trying to teach the younger one but football has already you know <laughs> football has occupied everything you know struggling really hard for people children to have education despite the fact that there's no electricity and everything and he is just bent on his football look at the details from Plemus bottle had to come in <laughs> Guys, I don't know if you guys can see, but this is literally a jean trouser. Can you guys see the details, the pockets? The, I don't know, the straps wear belts and a lot of plastic. It's amazing how much this guy, how much effort. Look, these are the boxes, the push, the buttons of the bar. Nice. impression of like this um I mean so nice so nice guys can you guys see the details in this uh, I don't know if they should you guys see the details like it's actually cut out you know and behind here is the wall so it's the, this on the wall it's amazing i'm going to shift back so that you can see the big picture i think these are african slaves working in a cotton plantation and then just by it is this rainforest yes see
not exactly what they want, so they are struggling to break free from the chains that have been imposed on them. And that's it. Political parties fighting against the people of the land. So guys, I just saw this painting that I found quite interesting. Hmm. <laughs> it's the um, two of the only religious paintings that I have seen here, and I'm going to show you guys you know, a bit of poetry. So this is literally the Last Supper, and it's painted by Sebastien, 2019. So, I guess that's Jesus sitting at the head of the table, and at this other end, oops, there is Judas plowing to go and betray Jesus. And they write it on, there's a write, writing under that says, we trust in you, Lord. Wow. And this same guy, if you look at this painting and then the other painting right there, you see that it's the same painter because he has like the same style of, you know, his same artistic style. Yeah, guys, so you guys should try as much as possible to come out and look at your own paintings every now and then because, I mean, you have a lot of foreigners who are here to consume our products whereas we don't we don't con so there's this guy's painting which um, Kanga Viking this one is so complex wow. looks like he's been doing this for ever Okay, this painting is a representation of the girls who were abdu 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 ab abducted from the north of Nigeria. Abducted from the north of Nigeria. And you can pretty much see them going. You see three girls here. You see more girls up here. Mm -hmm. you, you play the person around. Play the person around, yes. Okay, wow. Guys, there you have all the artists who exhibited today. And they are being presented. each and every one of you guys to just come to the gallery at your free time to just go past and see you know Cameroonian artists and just appreciate the work that they are doing okay guys bye